Um, so yeah, so just typically today's the day that um, you know Mark knows he's going into some big hills, like one of the biggest hilliest days that he's going to have in this whole around the world. And typically this morning we check the winds and um, well we kind of knew yesterday that the wind was coming in suddenly turning north east, which means it's just straight on his straight on his head. It's about 15 knots or so. That's what it's saying. And just to top it off, this morning he basically... Ah, oh, thanks Al. I'm hungry. Uh, this morning typically he um, uh, just spontaneously had projectile vomiting twice on the road, which is just a bit of a concern for me because... Well, and for him. Um, because, yeah, he's got a big hilly day. He's got headwinds. Um, needs his energy levels up. But also we were just about to come into we came into a city that we had to be making lots of turns it was really fast roads lots of junctions and he just hadn't eaten anything so i'd give him a smoothie that went down first thing followed that by a wrap which and these were both foods that he's had before and you know it's not anything that's contaminated and stuff because we've all been drinking the milk and eating the eggs and stuff um and yeah gave him the wrap and literally two bites into the wrap he threw up um, and then just said he was feeling quite full after the smoothie and actually, yeah, so whether he just, you know, he wished he'd not eaten that wrap, which is, you know, is what it is. Um, then tried to give him electrolytes, 15 minutes later he threw up again. Um, and so then gave him an antiemetic, which is a small tablet to sort of try and settle his stomach. Um, but then we went straight into climbing and then the problem is, is we're in a follow vehicle and we can't be right next to him so I can't get food to him very easily. Um, and he, so then he just, yeah, he has not a lot in the tank so as much as I could was trying to get him either jelly babies and little biscuits, sort of breakfast biscuits that are sort of oats and honey and they seem to go down well and stay down which was good. So he had like literally about eight biscuits. Um, but he just didn't really fancy anything else. Gave him a peppermint tea, some mints to suck on, sweets to suck on. My concern was that his blood sugar levels were going to be dropping. Busy roads, junctions, and I just suddenly thought, you know, he's just going to make a silly mistake because he's, his blood sugars are low, his cognition is low. But thankfully he made it to break, so now he's having a good sleep. Um, and then, yeah.